Democrats are seizing on a scandal surrounding congressional candidate Carl DeMaio. Today, protesters gathered outside a, pun, a private fundraiser for DeMaio in Pacific Beach, calling attention to new accusations of sexual harassment against the Republican candidate. San Diego reporter Carlos Delgado has the story. San Diego police and CHP officers surrounded this Pacific Beach home on Saturday as more than 70 people, who also included the Speaker of the House, John Boehner, gathered for a private fundraiser to raise money for Carl DeMaio's congressional campaign. There are allegations that are out there that need to be considered by the voters as they go to the polls on November 4th. But it also comes during a scandal surrounding the congressional candidate. DeMaio is being accused by former campaign staff member Todd Bosnich. In a CNN interview, Bosnich claims he was a victim of sexual harassment while he worked for DeMaio. He asked me to come over to his office, which is in the back, and when uh, I came over to his office door, was open, and he was uh, masturbating. DeMaio denies the allegations brought up against him, as he has before, saying they are fabrications because the former aide is a suspect in a May break-in at his campaign office. He also says Bosnich was let go for plagiarism. Absolutely untrue. Meanwhile, back outside the private home, a few protesters held signs that read, Dirty DeMaio, and I stand for Todd, referring to Bosnich. There have been allegations like this before, but it never, no one ever proved, proved them. So I just want people to really find out what this candidate is about. The former chair of the San Diego County's Democratic Party, Jess Durfee, has also sent a letter to the state attorney general urging her to take action right away. We're calling for her to recuse herself and have the attorney general investigate this. Local political analyst John Dadian says this is a closely watched race. This race is so close and it's national prominence. Okay, many, many weeks ago the gloves came off, now the brass knuckles are on. And he says the accusations could hurt Carl DeMaio just 25 days before the election. If one side or the other gets traction in the next three weeks, meaning if it looks like one side is more credible than the other, uh, that could tip the race. In Pacific Beach, Carlos Delgado, San Diego 6 News. Now, in a statement today, DeMaio's campaign spokesperson said in part, quote, Partisan political opponents are just manufacturing drama 25 days before the election to disrupt our efforts to raise the resources we need to get Carl's positive message out.